What's going on, everyone? Welcome back. I hope everybody's having a great day. All right, guys, we're going to go way back in the Curiosity rover when it was on Sol 542. Now, these are one of the photos that it's really hard to pull us out. Why? You'll see in a second. Watch this. This is the photo. Look how dark this photo looks. Now, if you go down to the bottom here, it is from Sol 542, and you can see right up here in the address bar, it is right here, the MSL, which is the Mars Science Laboratory, or the Curiosity rover. And over here, you can see it's NCAM, so it's a nav cam. So let's have a look at this thing up close. This is full resolution right here. And you can see, look how dark this thing is, man. Seriously? Why is it super light up on, in the, supposedly in the sky, but yet on the ground, it's completely crap? Let me guess, the sun setting? Uh, I don't know about you guys, but I've always said these mountains look fake. I think they're just trash. Uh, I think this area is a lot more vast than what it's showing or where they're at and these may actually be bogus not maybe all of it but i think a lot of it is now we can actually zoom into this and the reason why i want to show you this first is because i want to show you what's possibly in the photo now then i'm going to brighten up for you guys to really have a look now i want you guys to take note of a couple things in here again without doing a thing to it this is straight from nasa jpl and just some of the fudging going on i mean the whole photo is actually fudge believe it or not but just some of the crap in here. Look at this. Let me just zoom in a little bit more. It's going to really break up on me, and I hate to do that. Let me just back out just to here. Okay. Right in this area here, you can see where it's been really fudged out. Like, they just went to town on this. But they left in several things. One of them looks like this little archway thing. And you can see the wall. of it, almost like some kind of a weird um, hangar type thing um, right here. And you can't see the bottom of it because they pretty much scribbled it out. But let's keep going to the left. And you can see all like little bits and pieces of things they didn't quite cover up. Like you can see this white piece right here. Comes over here. You can see it right here. And there's another one here. Continue to go to the left. This is where it gets cool because, again, lines, lines, lines. Lines are everything. If you look at this, most of this looks pretty flat. And I think you guys would agree. However, when you get into this photo, look at the lines. There's one right here, very faint. One. This goes up like this here. It kind of goes up and over two lines. There's something else right here. Take note, too, without doing a thing to this photo, look at the white objects sitting right here. You can literally see a line coming down, a corner, and it's going over. Can you guys see that? Check that out. You can literally see it ghosted out. There's like a little speck of clarity right there. Now, white continues on over. A little bit of white they didn't take out. White right here they didn't take out. Keep going over. Again, look at the lines right here. There's things all in this whole background, guys. And I believe it goes much higher than that because I believe there's things that are a lot bigger. And this mountain, so to speak, is actually like a template. And it's dropped right on the photo so you don't see anything behind it. Now, of course, that's just pure speculation. But I've seen things which look like, like it comes through the background. Does that make sense? Uh, it shouldn't, meaning it shouldn't be coming through. Um, again, here we go. Look at this right here line right here going straight across down there's another line just under that so in other words my point is from here up these objects in it have height there's things there that are in this photo and they're literally making it look like it's almost like a 2d these are one of the photos that are so dark it's hard to find anything in it now this is what i thought was pretty cool look at the way the ground over here does this goes like this goes up goes up and you can see what looks like almost like a pathway or some kind of other objects laying in a row in a really smooth out area. See that? But it looks like there's a wall right here. It goes down, slopes down like this here. See that? And goes across. Let's keep going. Check this out. This is what I thought was amusing. This is what really caught my eye was this right here. See it comes over. Nice corner, sharp corner. And it's white. Comes down. Nice corner. Goes across. And they've grayed it out where it's literally like you can see it's gray. But it actually goes white across and into the back. Also right here, this is white loop type thing. It goes like this, comes around. This object right here is super faint, and it's hard to see until you see it enhanced. This right here this looks like almost like a U-shaped object right here. But again, I want you guys to focus your eyes just for a moment. Pause it if you have to. And I want you guys to look at this area right here. It's the one, two, three. There's actually a layered objects, structures, Call them what you will. They're literally right here in the background. And you can see all kinds of shapes. Just look at this. One, two, three circles. Can you guys see that right there? Almost near the middle of the screen right now. One, two, three circles. Line. 
this is going up straight like this. There's objects literally right here. See that? Right there. It's it's the whole background has got something in it. But if we were to do this, right? You can't see the background and it's completely darkened out. I wonder why that is. Well, let's get into this a little bit more. I'm going to go ahead and go to Photoshop because I want to really expose this thing for you guys. Bring up the exposure and then anything that's white, we're going to maximize its brightness to bring it out for you, right? All right. Boom, right off the bat. Okay. So let's go to the back first of all. Make that dark again and go to the back. Okay. Bring it up. Much better, right? Now, you, if you notice, you can see what looks like right here. See this corner right here going down? This goes across. Almost has this overhang. You can see like it's shadowy under here. See that? You can see that right here. But this object is literally coming out like this, and it's completely fudged out. They're completely taking it out. This, here's that weird, looks like that little, little hanger type thing. And then it goes down to the back, and it comes back down. They've literally put this mess in the way right here to really take out what's really there. We got another object right here. Almost looks like some kind of pipe. Do you guys see that right there? Right there. Not sure what to make of that. But again, here we go with the ledge thing right here. Now I'm gonna get over to this area where you can see these lines just a hair bit better. Now it's not fully enhanced, but take note of this. Check this out. Notice how you can see what looks like squares coming down. Okay, this one right here I was telling you about goes like this, goes over, goes up like this. This whole white piece down here, you got this bottom piece here. Okay, you've got the middle piece right here. And you can see what looks like these other white pieces right here. I don't know if you guys can see that. And then it's, this goes across as well. There's objects in here and they just don't want you to see them, guys. It's as simple as that. Now, let's come way over here because this is where it gets more and more bizarre. Here's the piece I was telling you about right here. Nice corner right there. You can see it nice and crisp. Boom. Goes in like this here. You can also see the inside. It looks like it mimics the outside. Right here. Goes across. Goes like this. Something's in here. And you can actually see a little piece of white doing this. And I'm going to fully enhance this for you guys in a second. Check this out. This object going like this. And then you can see what looks like these little, I don't know what to make of these, going across, goes down like this. Whatever these things are, you can see something, again, the lines going like this, another one right here. And of course, it's all been like, you can see like they just kind of went like this, like just scribbled over it. Or some kind of algorithm that the computer does, it literally just takes this stuff out, right? And here's what I was talking about earlier. It looks like flat ground when you first look at it, but something's hidden right here. You can see it's off the ground. Do you guys see that? It's, it's, well, it's actually, let me go a little closer to this object, meaning tighten it up a little bit. See this right? You can literally see a shadow right here under it, under this corner. There's a shadow under it. So this thing is literally off the ground, but they put so much crap over it right here. They just kind of just fudged it over, just made it, try to blend it in with the ground. You guys see that? Okay. But this right here is going up like this. Going over like that. There's some objects here. I'm not sure what to make of those, but it looks like it's kind of squared off. See that right there? And there's something inside. Something right here. But look at the way this thing looks like it's got a wall right here of some sort. And then it goes up into whatever this mess is over here. But let's back up just a little bit so we can clear it up. And guys, I mean... You can literally see these little things in the back being hidden. And for good reason. Look at this. Guys, see that? Right there. Now, I'm going to back out. I'm going to start showing you guys the enhancements that I've done. Now, on the next step, you can see these things are starting to pop. See this right here? What I was talking about right here, you got this. See that? These things are literally in the photo. In other words, there's height to these things. This is coming around right here, going across, 
you guys see that now? I'm going to just back out a little bit, but you can see the height now to these objects right here. Check the way this thing does this. It goes like this, and it looks like it steps down like this is a little deeper, and this goes to this piece. It looks like it's here, and then it steps down a little bit right to this one. You can see the nice 90-degree angle. This goes like this, kind of like comes out like that. I just noticed that. You guys see that? Does this. It looks like it just comes out like in a weird way like that. But notice the objects in here. Weird looking objects. It's almost like they're built into the side of a hill. Maybe they're just structures to begin with. But they do a great job of trying to hide these things. This I get a kick out of. This is pretty funny. Right here, these. Come on. You can literally see they've literally painted these things out. Literally see that. Look at this. See, like you can see right here, kind of looks you can see it shady, common sense, right? And then look at the difference here. And you can see these things have literally been blackened out right here, all three of these. And if you go to the other ones, it's no different. These right here. Is it possible that these things are shrubs, plant life, and they're just trying to hide what's in here? Good possibility, right? Who knows? It's pure speculation, but how do we know? Um, let's bounce way over to this side, because this is the side I wanted to show you again. Now, you can see these things pretty darn good. Again, we've got this going like this. One. Two. You've got... Whoop, that was actually wrong there. This literally, I can see it going down like this. And then this item goes like this here. What is that, guys? And again, we've got this piece right here. And you see where it literally shapes the same way that the outside does. Yeah, that's natural. Sure. Now, again, if we saw this on Earth, we'd say, oh, my God, this is remnants of a, you know, of a civilization. Not these people. No, it's, it's your pareidolia, man. It's, that's all there is to it. Look at this. Well, it looks like another inner door or something like that. At least the shape of it looks like that. All right. Let's go to the fully enhanced. And here we go. Now, you can see these other objects. I'm going to back up just a little bit. And you can see there's multiple things here, man. Look at this. I mean, between things that are just... You can see what look like flat top areas. You can see this right here. Now, for the heck of it, watch this. I'm going to go ahead and take this stuff out. And I want to show you something. I'm going to bounce back and forth. I want you to keep an eye on this area right here. Just concentrate on that. It is right there. It's no different. See it? All of these objects... I'm going to do this in white. Don't need to do it in red, seeing it's that dark. Um, and you could just see these items, and I can see this as plain as day. Look at this. I don't know if you guys can see that. I can see it as plain as day. All I did was just highlight it and bring it out. That's all I did to this. Take your time. Pause this any way you want to. And just have a look. Again, bounce back over to this side. And again, we've got these weird-looking platforms. Were they? Was it possible? It was like a foundation to building at one at one point, right? You see these objects coming out from the top. I believe this is much more. This is much higher than this than what we're seeing. I think what they did here, because you can see it's supposed to be the backdrop or the actual uh, inside of the crater wall of Gale Crater. Um, and I think it's rubbish, to be truthful with you guys. I think it's absolute rubbish. And I think what they, what they did is, again, they drop it down like a template so you can't see what might be much higher than what they're seeing, what we're seeing here, right? Here's another kind of goofy little objects right here in the back. See that right here? It literally, I think it still goes like this. I think it's still, this thing continues on. It goes down like this. But what this is is beyond me. I don't know what that is. Almost like there's a pair of steps that are coming up. You guys see that? Right here. I don't know what to make of that thing. But you can see it like there's like different parts and pieces. Like they, you see part of it and then it stops. Why? Manipulation. 
maybe perhaps a lot of this stuff is still buried and we're just now starting to see this. I saw this right here and I couldn't, I don't know what to make of that either. But again, it looks like these things are like going straight across practically. Of course, I didn't go very straight with that, but regardless, um, right here, I can try to do it a little better. Well, that wasn't too much better, but either way, you've got these things that look like they're just sitting right there. And again, it looks like we have this, you can see the white actually coming through here. See this? Kind of looks like it's kind of, it's not really smooth right there, but then it goes like this. Kind of looks like it goes down and then comes back down. This stuff here has been scribbled in. They're just using that to just take out whatever they want to take out. And you can see this object goes further back than this gray area. Right here. See that? Yeah, pretty crazy stuff, see it? All right. Now we've got these objects everywhere. It's just little pieces peeking out here and there. It's one of those photos that it's really hard to find uh, the objects or anomalies in because it's so dark. And I can kind of understand that. They're doing everything they can to hide these things. So what's the best way to do it? Docking it up. And now again, we've got these weird three pieces here. I'm not sure what to make of that. Here's the overall. I'm just going to back out. And guys, have a look. These objects are in the photo. No doubt about it. I'll just back out of here a bit. And we'll... All you got to do is look at the brighter spots. Don't look so much at the dark areas, just the brighter spots. And you can see that all those pieces are right there in your face, but they're being hidden in plain sight. What better way to hide anything, right? Anyway, guys, you will get the link to this as always. You guys know that. But, guys, do me a favor. Just have a look at it, and you'll be astounded at some of the stuff you can see. And I know a lot of you guys are getting into, these, uh, into Photoshop yourself. Some of you have GIMP. Uh, you've been telling me, uh, you've been inspecting these things, and kudos to you guys for doing this, man. That's awesome. I'm glad you guys are doing it. Drop your thoughts down below. Drop your comments. Uh, I want to hear your thoughts. Is it nothing more than rocks to you? Is it something more? You can see what I have enhanced and brought out. To me, my opinion, it's not natural. Is there a lot of natural things around these objects? Sure. But those objects I pointed out, definitely not. So just let me know what you guys think. And like always, guys, like the video and please share. Always appreciate you guys know that. Anyway, guys, got some more cool stuff coming up, so stay tuned for that. You guys have yourself a great day, and I'll see you on the flip side.